Hello, welcome back to Venus. I'm Mick. We're playing Station Ears. Hey, up. So we are back for another go. It's day 56. Ah, it looks like we've got a storm coming in. That'll be handy for me batteries. So they've been running a bit low of light. Uh, but anyway, food's growing. Um, I think I've actually been up all night and. Uh, I've done a bit of bit of bit of bits and bits here and there. Some of the boring stuff. I've just been putting up some cladding here and there, and basically just passing a bit of time for the uh, trying to get the um, the waiting for the plants to grow, um, waiting for the place to cool down. Got to get some get some. Uh, Get myself going again. Can't think of too many things to try and think of at once. Um, so I got the plant, got the plants are growing, they're producing oxygen, my filters are producing nitrogen and cooling the place down a bit. So uh, that's just gonna take a bit of time. So I've just been doing some rewiring and some of the boring stuff that you gotta do. Uh, I think I'll put up some more windmills. So when this storm comes along, it should load up those batteries real quick. Ah, close the visor. Oxygen critical. I left Bill Wilson in there with the pumpkins. No, no pumpkins. Oh, it looks like the storm started. Sounds like it. Sounds like it. That's called looking with your ears. So now our power. Oh, 65 kilowatts. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. 35% on the battery. I expect that'll go up real quick. Because they're all looking pretty sad at the moment. But, um, anyway. So, we have... Our nitrogen producers in there, they are going along nicely. I'll have to crack that open and see how we're going. Our greenhouse up the top is down to 195, so I'm not going to pull that one out in a big hurry. Uh, but everything else is looking good. I'll have to pick some flowers ready for the other greenhouse. When it's ready, of course. Uh, but other than that, we are looking good. We are sitting on. We got there seven percent oxygen. Well, it will be seven percent oxygen until we open up the other rooms, and that'll suck some of it out. But we're making progress. We're getting towards breathable. Now, uh, I think in here today it might be about time that we automate this gas collection. So then we can start pumping it back out into here instead of just holding it in the tanks here, where it's not doing anybody any good. Um, so that's what we'll be doing today. So we'll need some bits, it's some bits to get that going. So I need some chips, computer, and probably some lights, an alarm, and let's get on with it. Uh, how are we doing for everything else? We're looking good. Got oxygen, got spare tanks, batteries are good. Rock and roll. Now, I have some lights. Oh, four. That's not going to be enough. Uh, I've done some smelting too while we've been waiting. There, yeah, that's a boring old thing, but it passes the time. 65 kilowatts. That's nice. Uh, so, what do I want? Some lights. I shall want a flashing light for my alarm. I don't think I still have one of them. Nope. Good. And some other lights, and a computer, and all sorts of stuff. Some copper. Um, come on, get, get it sorted. Copper. Oh, that's a big chunk of copper. That's okay. We'll use it. Uh, so we want four, five, six, seven, eight. That'll be eight. A computer. 
Ah, cold. That'll do us. And an editing card, some icy housings. And I think that's about all we need, isn't it? And some chips, of course. Um, so, she'll need four of them. I don't have a temperature sensor in that room. I don't remember now. I'll probably better make one of them. I need a sensor. Right, so that'll take a little while to print off. Then we can start chucking them in. Um, I don't think I need any more pipes or anything up there. Very good, so I can move the I can move the active vent. So instead of blowing it outside, it's not blowing it outside, I switched it off. It's just blowing into the room, isn't it? So it should will be pressurizing, so hopefully it hasn't overpressurized too much. But I'll be able to suck all the nitrogen that's been producing into the waistline instead of blowing it outside. And I shall recycle that back into the habitat. Hopefully it's all cooled down enough to reuse. So oh, come on! And what else? I guess I could put up some lights there because it's so bumbling around in the dark. And lovely day. Lovely day. Furnace is still going strong. It's warming up. We ought to make some more steel, although I don't need that in a big hurry, do I? Uh, how are we going? Oops, that's four. And four is all you can make, so that will be good. I've got you. Ah, uh, probably don't want them. Take some of you. Guess you often come in handy. Some walls, probably some flat walls. If I had some steel, that'll do us. Make me some of them. You. And you, computer, IC housing, alarm, um, lights, four. I think that should be straight all we need. Um, let's just grab them. That'll be a couple. I think I had a couple short, but we'll do. Right now. Let's get to it. Oh, all red lights before, they're all green lights now. 96, did I switch you back on? No, I didn't. Switch you on. Start making me oxygen. That's good, that's good. Now, let's see how we're cooking in here. Oh, I should bring up some pipes and put in a, a tank refiller. So I can refill that from the carbon dioxide now, because I've now got oxygen out here. I don't want to be refilling my tank with some of my precious oxygen. Whoa! 121 degrees. And yeah, that pressure's going up. 170 kilopascals. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. So, I don't want to blow you outside anymore. I'll probably want to hook you up to the waistline. I'll put you up there. I'll blow you into the, the khaki line and that will be uh, 
that will save it and then be pulled out in these things. And I shall reclaim it. And the storm is over. Woohoo! Now, um, I want some chips. Um, why not? That'll do us. Um, Well, good a spot as any. Whoops, wrong button. Um, oh, screwdriver, you're good. And my other chip for controlling the room can go there, I guess. Why not? Oh, I'll need me labeler. Uh, you're good. You're good. And you're good. Now, looks like I have cable there. So I should just need to... Whoops. I can't cut those ones out, so... Just do a little trick with that and out they all come done now you should need to hook you up to a pipe with one of them Cable can hook up to there. And oh, damn, wrong button again. Ah, oh, dear, move my keyboard over a little bit. Yeah, there we go. I bet that doesn't solve a thing. It'll work in my brain, so. That's the only thing that's going to be a worry. Uh, to you, to there, and you, into there. Bingo. Now you lot. I can get you from there, 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 and there should be a cable across there. To you. You, you, you. Now you don't have a cable, so I'm going to have to bring you right around. I think that's a cable I just pulled out, isn't it? Hmm. Um. Whoops. You, you. So you're hooked up. You're hooked up, you're hooked up. Um, some lights. So I want some indicators for my filters. I can put them up to there because I have a cable up there. Room, so it'll be six of them. Uh, LED, diode slide. That's the one we're looking for. Bingo. And uh, while we're here, let's just put some lights up on the roof. Um, let's put the round ones in. One there. One there. And probably into there will do us. Uh, 
And let there be light. Oh, I already had me light off. <laughs> I guess I won't switch it off then. Um, now, the alarm had to go outside. And I probably don't have enough cables to do that. Awesome stuff. That's alright, I need the labeler anyway. Um, oops. So, oh, look at that. Perfect. Um, right, so, light outside. I'll get myself the labeler. And I forgot to put that in. Okay. Um, so wherever the cooler goes. Oh, we can put that in anywhere. Oops. Try one of them. I could put that on the roof, couldn't I? That'll get it out of the way. Yep, try again. Put it there. Um, now, put the light outside and we should be good. Eleven degrees. I'll probably crack that open, and this room, the rest of the base, might be able to absorb that 111 degrees. Now I'll, I'll finish wiring it up, and then we'll do that. So I don't want to shock the shock the plants too much. Look, and I'm not even using burning through a heap of oxygen. That's good. And I've got to put my light out there. What I came out for is there it is there. Good, that'll be my alarm for the filters. Now the labeler. Yoink. Good, and my chips. And some cable. Yep. Oh. Now it'll do. Uh, can I just print more cable? No. 365. No, I won't just print that and let it go. That will be a little bit more cable than I'll want. Although probably exactly the amount of cable that I'll need. Um. Lights. Now, um. Is that it? Oh, wait a minute, the stuff putting me in my, 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 my jetpack filler. So I shall want, wow, just running around in circles now, aren't I? Um, so you, we don't put up there anymore. So I'll need you. I shall need some pipe. That'll do. I shall want a regulator. Um, is that all I want? And some paint, of course. We're going to make it official. Now, um, for the pressure regulators. We want a short, a short input length, don't we? So I might just grab a valve. Nice spelling. If I might actually just grab a heap of them. So my experiments, it does take a long time to fill up using a pressure regulator. If I put a just a regular valve before I put in the pressure regulator, it should operate a lot quicker. I've run out of copper. 1150. I'll grab a few of them and start separating out my my pipe networks. 
because I found that if your pipe does get too long, it does tend to sometimes give you errors where you just lose all the gas in the pipe. Oxygen critical. And if you've got a very long pipe, that can be a lot of gas. Ah, that might be enough. Thank you. Yoink. And, whoops. Um, throw them away now that I've come out and got them. Grab you. Now. <sighs> if I can relieve the pressure in here, it will start cooling down quicker. So that might be some of the first things we do. I can run that using the active vent uh, through the computer. So if I set that up to depressurize down to 120 kilopascals, it's about 106 degrees now. That's lost quite a few degrees very quickly. And what have we got in here? That's 67% nitrogen. Lovely. That's what we want. Um, right. Now you I think let's get rid of them. I'll put in some valves through here. And I'll switch them all on, as uh, of course I still want them to work. But now if I have an error in either one of these gas pipes, I only lose whichever part of the pipe has the error in it. I won't lose absolutely everything. Which will be, uh, well, not handy, but better than losing a whole lot anyway. Yoink. Probably should do these ones too. Well, especially the wise base pipe anyway. Um, so, where'd you go? Um, probably just grab you there. There we go. Now, as we're saying with these ones, if I put you, no, no, there we go. If I put you there, I can put you and you. Put you. Nope, that way. Put you there, and I can put you. Nope. There we go. So, now because that has a short length of pipe before and after, it should run a lot bit quicker than if it had a long length of pipe on that side of it. At least that's the way it seems to work. Um, nope, that way. Come on. You. You and got a heap of them. There. Good O. And of course the coat of paint, make it official. That will be my jetpack refiller. So I need to wire you up. Um, I can do that, turn around and go to the lights on the roof. Oh, 
Come on, here we go. Boom. So now. Oop. Turn you up. I thought the hard way, well, I've got the labeler in, the, in my pocket. That makes good sense. Why not? Uh, maybe five. Five meg. And switch you on. Pipe network. That's the room. Pipe, why has pipe network got nothing in it? Aha. Switch on the valve, you dope. Now that's pressurizing very quickly now. So yeah, put a valve in there to separate that pipe network. That that works a treat. Um, right now the pressure in here, 173 is still going up. So I shall want you. Shall be. Now exhaust vent. And I shall put you onto here. Oops, there it is. Oh, missed it again. There it is. Right. He's got no code in there. Good O. I probably better name you as well. Uh, here the, the room environment. So we are talking to the room environment. Okay. Uh, what's the vent? The vent on D0. Really, all you want to do is set it, isn't it? Um, so he saved the vent mode one, which is outlet. Save the vent um, pressure external, the pressure in the room, 120. Pressure internal, pressure in the pipe. 20 megapascals, so we don't want to blow up the system. Uh, so save vent, turn it on. Vent, and we'll lock it to make sure I don't do anything too stupid with it. Okay, export you. We're good. Oh, and we're working. I hope. No, it's not going too crazy. We should be safe. Right, so that is you done. Now, I should just need to label all of these things. This <laughs> is starting to be a worry. Um, that'll be the O2 housing. O2 filtration. O2 diode slide 1. And the O2 diode slide 2. No, it's still good. It's alright. 119, 120, we're good. And I'll label the other ones. Two. And I'm pretty sure I have labeled the tanks outside. And chip you. Chip you. Right. How are we going? 
We're still good. I think you're working. We can safely ignore you now. Now, uh, let's go. Now, on this one, I should go to the oxygen. Now, I'm just going to load uh, script. My uh, editor, Gas Harvester version 3, I've done did a long time ago. Um, Gas Harvester v3. There it is. Now, we can't just load this one up exactly as it is because uh, this one is not quite made for this. So, on this one, I don't have any temperatures. I don't have any temperature control on my tanks because the uh, program will actually look at the temperature of their storage tank. So, if it's above 30 degrees, don't suck any more in. Just wait until the tank's cooled down. Well, I don't have any way of cooling the tank down, so... I'm going to have to get it to ignore that. I'm just going to say a thousand. I'll say minus a hundred degrees. Um, whoops. And I'll set the tank to 20 kilopascals. Right, so that should allow it to work. Um, but I want to do something a little different on this one. So if I export that one, uh, where are we? I shall need to set it all up, of course. So the tank will be the O2 tank. I have labelled them, that is good. Filtration shall be the O2 filtration, the analyzer, we'll be getting the, the information of what's in the tank will be from the waste tank. The diode will be the O2 O2 diode slide 1 and of course the O2 diode slide 2 and there is no alarm. Now reset you, switch it on And that's not working, because why isn't that one on? What did I do wrong? O2, oh, they're both one, okay. I can handle that. Now it's two. There we go. Now, i pull you out. Yep, yep. Now I'm gonna change it a little, because I actually want that light to come on once the filter has run out. So when it comes out, the light comes on, so I know that it's not just a little bit left, that it is actually off, or it is actually empty. So, uh, a little change on that, and we can actually change change the detection on it as to decide whether or not to switch on. It has decided to switch off. Right, so where we're looking at the filter condition is just here. So it checks it all, divides by 100, has a setting on that one there. So it says, if it's equal to zero, uh, I can actually just change that to a set equal to zero, can't I? That'd be a better use of the term. So all that's doing, so if the filter is zero, set R0 to one. So that's what's being used for the alarm switch on the flashing light for the alarm part of the program. So I should just be able to save back to the there's no S in diode. D-I-O-D-E on R0. Confirm. Export. No bugs, we're good. Ah, uh, see, now the light comes on. That's what we want to see. Lights off. Lights on, lights off. We're good. Now, I was also going to change the detector on it as well. So now, I'm going to say total moles. That's a new command that's come out in one of the updates since I wrote this. So we can say, if we have, say, 
two moles in the waste tank, switch it on. Um, export. And we're happy. Right now, I'll just switch that to the other two and we should be good to go. So, into export, CO2 export, and we should be good. So, it's a matter of setting it all up again. So, that shall be into tank, into filtration, waste tank, nitrogen diode. Another nitrogen diode. That's oxygen. Nitrogen, 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 nitrogen. We're good. That's good. That's good. So you shall be CO2. CO2 tank. CO2 filtration, waste tank, CO2 diode, and CO2 diode. We're good. And you're on as well. Look at all that nitrogen coming in now. Oh, ooh, it's 80 degrees. Ah, uh, now we're blowing straight back out into my face again. Um, well, let's hope the base can absorb that. Now we're flicking on and off. That's good. That means they're working. Ah, uh, excellent. Now, um, our alarm. I'll put our alarm back on this one here. So I'll need to find my flashing light onto... Onto there, flashing light. Where are you? Flashing light. Flashing lights onto D1. Um, room environment. Import. So now, yep, first bug for the day. Nice. Flasher D1. Go on, bug log. Now, uh, I shall need a loop for that one. And we'll start our main loop. So, I can now just uh, load batch from the flasher. Because all those, fl oh, not from the flasher, from the diode. Because all those diodes, when any, any of them have run out, the light will come on. So, if I just load a batch command from all of them to find out if any of them are on and then save that straight to the flasher so if any of them are on the flasher should come on um, so i shall need a uh, diode you try again Um, on uh, maximum the property and so which way is it? Is it the type and then the property or the other way around? Uh, reload batch Variable then the mode. Oops, better load it into a variable too, hadn't I? R0. So load into R0. Let's do it right, shall we? Diode. We'll define it. Now it'll make sense. Uh, so, we just save that back into the flasher 
on what we've just read, R0. Yield. Jump back to the start. Oh, room environment, export. No errors, we're good. Our light, there it is. I pull out, yo. Flashing light is on, good o. Oh, I think we've had a win. Ah! No! The whole base is ruined! No! That's... Yeah. I'll have to pull the whole thing down and start again now. No! Oh, I could just pull it out perhaps. No, the whole playthrough is ruined. I've got a tile in the wrong way. Ah, uh, there we go. And, ah, uh, oh, crisis averted. Cool, that was a close one. Um, I put a roof in too. Come on, there we go. There we go. Boom! Oh, the place looks lived in. Well, lived in by someone a bit neater than me. Oh, I didn't wire up that. It's all right. Through the magic of fudging through walls. Oh, I turned my light off. Boom, hooked up. And I'll use you later. Uh, once I've got these things switched off, I'll need that to put in a temperature regulator. Speaking of which, we are still going pretty good. How are we going pressure-wise? 5 megapascals. That is plenty. Nice! So, in here... We have 73 degrees. Mm. Can, I, can I open up 73 degrees? Or well, 71% nitrogen. Look at that! Look at that! I can't breathe it, but um, pretty impressive nonetheless. Um, I'll leave you lot there. Uh, put all in all those valves. You, I'll probably need. I'll just put you there. And I think we're done. Nice. Oh, I could put the maybe not put the roof up there. So, I think we are done in there. Now, I could pull out the, the wall upstairs. If I can open that up. That's a much smaller room, so maybe I can absorb all of that. 155 degrees. It is admittedly a lot hotter. But not that much. It's 33 degrees out here. Um, um, hmm. Um, time. Will it cause that door to close? Yes, it will. <laughs> it didn't like that. Didn't you? That's too hot for the plants. Right. 
Well, that's all right. It means the plants are safe. 51 degrees. 42. 39. Ooh, dear. Twenty-five. Come on, absorb that temperature. Oh, I think it's still on it. Oh, I think it's still on it. Okay. So, I'll need some plants. I'll need a water canister. I'll probably need to rip this up and try and remember what I did in here. I had to reconnect that pipe. I'll have to connect that up. I think all the rest was connected up from memory. So you can come out and I shall need a door. You too. Right. A door, a tank, some cables. I could probably just put the cables in there, couldn't I? Oops. <laughs> Uh, some water pipes to connect them up. A door. Yeah, I think we've absorbed all that heat. Only just, but it's good enough. Now let's get rid of this annoying alarm. Oops. Oxygen critical. Now, has that ruined my oxygen supply? Oh, I'm still at 7%. Thought after releasing all that carbon dioxide, it must have just taken it all out again. Um, so, water pipes. Um, gas displays we don't need. Uh, probably don't need you anymore. Oh, you. I wanted a door. A door. A regular old door, if I have copper. Um, cables, we'll grab some more cables. Right. Now I shall need some plastic and glass, which I have. Um, I'll need some seeds, which I don't have. And that's about all I need. Um, I can't just let, really let you run all the time, can I? Uh, well, let's just say that's enough for now then. Now, oh, did I have that thing set up on a pipe? I don't remember. I'll just grab one just in case. Ah, oh, I forgot my tank. That's all right. I don't have to go through an airlock to get to it. Yay! It's actually open. Let's cycle that airlock as I'm walking past. Now, you go that way. Um, so, door. Yep, that one. There we go. 
sir. Yeah. Um, how am I going to do that? I'll hook up to the doors. And you're all hooked up along that back wall there. Um, so how am I going to get you out? That's not what I want. You're already doing that. Um, so, how am I going to cross that pipe and that cable? you like that. Um, and I guess in a horrible hack. Oh, what are you missing now? What have I disconnected? Disconnect. No, oh dear, what have I done? <laughs> ah, there it is. Trying to bumble around in the dark. Now we're happy. Wow. Uh, yeah, I see an easier way I could have done it, but it will do. That's the wrong one, wasn't it? Two tone. No! No, 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 no. Wrong way again. Ah, it's not a good day for ACD, is it? Ten. There we go. Oops, wrong one. There we go. It doesn't match the ones on that side of the door. No! Get over it. Um. Boom. We're good. We're good, we're good, we're good. Close you up. Now, pipes for you. Um, yeah, not on the window. I can pull it out into that room. Oh, yeah, that looks ugly. Oh well, it'll do. Um, right, just need a tank. 
Uh, maybe some blue paint. Blue paint for the floor. Purple paint for the cooler. And I think we're just about done. 48 degrees. Did I have to adjust you at all? Um, right, that pressure. Okay, we're good. I'm happy with that. We'll keep those temperatures. Don't need to adjust. So, water tank. I'll need some ice. Need some ice too. Right. Wee. Wee. So, I shall want a water tank. Uh, liquid tank. Iron. There we go. Give me one of them. Ah, some paint. And some purple. And some blue. I'm happy enough blue to do the floor. Who knows? Ah, uh, Blue. There we go. And the tank. Yoink. Right. We have our other garden done. I'll need to get some seeds. And... <gasps> That's the wrong floor. Oh, everything's going wrong. Now, yep, that one. Bunk. We're good. There we go. I shall give it a garden blue floor. I could put some lights in here, maybe. Oh, yep, did run out of paint. Have to paint these ones, even though you can't see them. Because the plants will know. There we go. Go, whoop. Air cooling. There we go. Um, 274 is getting down to zero. Oh, we're good. We are good. She so might switch that cooling temperature up to 10 degrees. Uh, 273 to 83. Confirm. Just don't paint the computer. Computers are for spilling coffee on, not for painting. There we go, we're on. And we're cooling down. That is good. So, we have some oxygen, plenty of CO2. Nitrogen is creeping up, which we want to see. 46.8 degrees. Come on, cool down, cool down. So I'll need some, I'll bunch to put some ice in there. That'll cool the place down a little. Uh, and I can grab some seeds. I may as well grab some. That's still giving me a red light, so I can't open that door yet. I think it's 47 degrees out here, and I think 20 something in the other room. So it'll say, no, 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 you cannot open that door. Something is wrong. This will be boring as crap, I'm just going to pick a heap of plants. Ha! 
Oh, that, was a, that looks like a pretty pathetic crop from getting from that. Um, anyway, now, replant. Uh, better wait for daytime so I can see what I'm doing. Ice. Ice, ice baby. Can I get seeds? I'm going to wait too late for them again. Yep. We don't need any more vodka plants. Plenty of pumpkins. All right, you stay away from those pumpkins. Well, hopefully if I time it this time, we might actually get some. Now I've got to go get some ice. Oops, visor. about time I put that chip back in my suit to close that for me. Nah, not today. Now we need to get some ice. Um, I don't think we have a special need for anything else. But, uh, put you back on furnace duty. Oh, okay. I do have a few things there. And now I can put in some copper. Just drop all the rest. Now, ice we're looking for. Um, Wilson was there a second ago. Ah, uh, well. Wilson? You didn't end up in the furnace, did you? Oh, you'll show up. Alright. How am I going? We're good. Ice. Right. Let's go. Light off, put you away. You're off, you're on. Yo, and yo, and yo, and we're good. Almost done. Come on, empty it out. There we go. Now, um, you can have a chunk of ice. Uh, 
Uh, I shall grab one of them if I have some silicon. Uh, that was just a one stack of silicon, was it? I should have looked when I grabbed that. That's a 50 stack. That's a better one. That'll do the job. So, you will do. You. I can put it up here. So, you can have some ice. pick up our plants. Now I can start planting them again. I'll be able to see what I have planted. Oh, good enough. Hello flowers. Happy to see you too. No escape. All planted again. More flowers. And now you lot. Okay, use some ice. And I can't carry everything. Um, well done. harvested that complete room. I think that room's got more flowers. So I should have enough to plant the up top room. Because it's a smaller room. Although that one has four rows. This one only has three. Um, well, once again, we'll find out. Now, uh, you can have some water. Wow, okay, so I got to them, got to them, got to them, and then started running out. So this is going to produce a hell of a lot more oxygen than the other room did. Um, that's cool. Can handle that down to 42 degrees. Oh, those mice should take care of that pretty quick. switched on the vent yet. Right, I better do that. So, gas sensor, pipe analyzer, active vent. Active vent is on D2. That's right, I did program it in. I just didn't switch it on, didn't I? I remember that now. There we go. Um, export event is now on 
and it's sucking it down to 120. That is what we want to see. So we're good. Well, it's still 41 degrees. Okay, so it's going to take a little while for the temperature in the base to come down. But here we go. We are all iced up. We have water. We have garden. Hydration critical. I have thirst. And some walls. What are you? That's all right. I meant to do that. I had to come down here and put those walls up completely deliberately, not by accident. Um, right, drink. Try again. Drink. Oxygen critical. There we go. Um, how is oxygen going? Oxygen, oxygen is down to 6%. Yeah, I feared that might be the case. Uh, there's Wilson, pounder. Um, drop you off there. Switch you off. You are empty, weren't you? Yep. Oh, you're hot enough to steal, though. Good out. Put you off. Put you off. Now, 55%. Wow, well, the benefits of that storm didn't last for very long. Um, where are we? I can probably grab you. No, you come with me. And we shall see if we can open up this other room. It's been one of our fastest cooling down rooms, so has it cooled down enough for us to use? Got the disc here in anticipation. Eight degrees. Ah, yes, that room has cooled down enough. That's lovely. Eight degrees. That'll take the sting off the other room. So. Thank you. Aha! No more airlocks. It's all inside base now. Nice, I still don't have much oxygen. Got a fair bit of nitrogen. Oh, I've got heaps of carbon dioxide, not that I really need it. Look at that. The base is opening up. Yay! <sighs> Enjoy the sunset. From amongst the air conditioners. And that's not the right wall. One of them. Well, we're in the process of making stuff look good. Okay. 
Oh, I've run out of sheets. <laughs> Wonder the why that wasn't working. Now you. Yeah, now officially a CO2 cylinder. What about my other jetpack? Jetpack critical. Yes, it is. That's that's fine. So we can easily get rid of you. Empty out the rest of you so we don't pollute the carbon dioxide. There we go. I can now make you officially a CO2 tank. Oh, I had run out of CO2. Ah, there we go. I now have a new jetpack, new jetpack refiller offer. Wow, that's irritating. Tick, 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 tick. But that's what will keep happening until the base has stabilised its atmosphere. Because it's still blowing it back in as quickly as it can. Yeah, you're not happy yet. Flowers are growing. Ah. Make me oxygen plants. <laughs> 35 degrees. It's cooling down. Whee! And I think we are done for the day. So, garden is expanded. It's open. New garden. And that one is going to get us a lot more, but it looks like it's got a lot more plants in it than the old one there, so that's going to make a lot more oxygen, even though it's a smaller room. But anyway, um, got that open. Our atmospherics is automated. Gas collection, it's all going good. And that's about all we got through for today, wasn't it? Oh, well, it's something. I mean, it's not, not nothing. That's day 58. It is time for a drink, a potato, oh, did I eat my other potato, or was it Shadow Man, Shadow Man ate my potato, bastard, um, nummy nums, Ah, uh, we are all good. Um, well, right out. So that'll do us for today. Till next time, happy building. See ya.